Yeah, I haven't. Yeah. When I was done, I went to Baltimore and then I pretty much wanted to get away for a little bit, just take a couple deep breaths. And, you know, I just had a, my first daughter then. And so now I'm getting a little more engaged, but, uh, you know, it's, I just needed a, a couple of years, I think, just to decompress a little. What do you think of the game today? Because it's changing. I mean, I'm not sure. You know, Mark Balger, when you've got Russell Wilson, you've got Colin Kaepernick and all those guys, I mean, this, the game's kind of changed a little bit, hasn't it, for quarters? I think it's cyclical. Yeah. When I was coming out, it was, you know, getting more into running quarterback league. Right. Then it went back. Right. I think it's going back a little more. I think it, it's just, you have to have the right fit. You know, Coach March was the perfect fit for me. He was Reed, he knew where to go with the ball. Tom Brady's been in the same system. Big man's been in the same system, but, you know, if, if you change coaches or if you're not comfortable, it never hurts to have a pair of legs, which I didn't have. <laughs> How about uh, looking back at the college game and, you know, for a long time your record stood and when Geno Smith came through with Dan Overson's uh, system, they started to fall. To watch that offense here at WVU and to see the direction that that program was going, uh, I mean, what was that like to you? To, did any, uh, you know, tinge of jealousy to no. see that they were throwing up those kinds of numbers? No. Never jealous as long as we're winning. Or, <laughs> yeah. But uh, I think it goes back to John's point where that's, I think, why the NFL is changing a little bit because there's not traditional football in college anymore. I mean, it's 60, 70% are doing the spread. And I think, you know, that you don't want to say hurt, but they're not learning how to read defenses. They don't, not even learn how to take a snap in a lot of cases. And so I think the NFL is adapting to what's going on in college. But again, I think. Defenses figure that out and they'll go back and forth. And I think as long as football doesn't change too much more, it'll keep doing that. When you played here, it kind of changed because Newton was a power eye guy and he liked to run it. And when you came in, they had to change the offense to fit what you did. And then, of course, you had guys around you to do that. I mean, talk about that because you were the guy that kind of changed that a little bit. Yeah. You know, I couldn't run, you know, I remember being a freshman, you know, putting the option and being the script. And I'm like, why is <laughs> I think after the first, you know, spring camp, after the fall, Richard, he was like, all right, I'm not even going to try. He wanted to do it so bad. He right. wanted to make me run off. Right. It's not going to threaten him. It's not going to threaten him. But, you know, it, it was fun because Coach Shimrell came in and we did. I know Coach Neal changed and started throwing the ball 25, 30 times a game. We might have been a little bit behind everyone else, but, you know, it was fun. Thank him for doing that because otherwise, you know, the option I wouldn't, I wouldn't have lasted too long. <laughs>